This is Optimal Living Daily, episode 1225, How to Deal with Uncomfortable Emotions and Reshape Your Identity by Benjamin Hardy of benjaminhardy.com, and I'm Justin Mollick. Happy Friday, happy good Friday, actually, and welcome back to Optimal Living Daily, or the OLD podcast, where I read to you from some of the best blogs I can find and get permission from. And this episode is brought to you by Hask. Hask hair care products are used on more Hollywood film and TV sets than any other brand. Hask offers high-performance formulas at affordable price points, including shampoos, conditioners, deep conditioners, shine oils, and dry shampoos that are designed to treat and repair all hair types and made from high-quality ingredients sourced from around the globe. Free of sulfates, parabens, phthalates, and gluten, plus cruelty-free, Hask products are available at CVS. Shop now in-store or online at cvs.com and learn more at haskbeauty.com. For now, let's get right to it and start optimizing your life. How to Deal with Uncomfortable Emotions and Reshape Your Identity by Benjamin Hardy of benjaminhardy.com. Jack Canfield once said, everything you want is on the other side of fear. And he's right, but I'm gonna take it one step further. Pain, discomfort, shock, boredom, imposter syndrome, awkwardness, fear, being wrong, failing, ignorance, looking stupid. Your avoidance of these feelings is stopping you from a life beyond your wildest imagination. These are the feelings that accompany a life of success. And yet, these are the very feelings you relentlessly avoid. Interesting how that works, right? Wealth, optimal health, incredible relationships, deep spiritual maturity are all available to you but you have to pay the price to have these things. The primary obstacle in your way is how you feel about what you need to do to have these things. Most people aren't willing to feel difficult emotions on a regular basis. However, if you're willing to disregard how you feel in the moment, you'll have access to a world of opportunity unavailable to 99% of the population. When you feel the fear and do it anyways, you get the satisfaction of living life on your terms. Instead of being a hostage to your emotions, you get to experience them more deeply. Hilariously, once you break past the emotional blocks and just act, it's never as bad as you think it will be. Make the decision and act. Napoleon Hill said, when your desires are strong enough, you will appear to possess superhuman powers to achieve. Similarly, Tim Grover has said, when you crave the end result, the hard work becomes irrelevant. Put most simply, When the why is strong enough, you'll be willing to do any how. The clearer and bigger the why, the bolder the how. Hence, if you 10X your why, you'll have insights about how to do things far more effectively than the norm. As Dan Sullivan has said, quote, when 10X is your measuring stick, you immediately see how you can bypass what everyone else is doing, end quote. If your dreams are big enough, you'll have to do different things than you've been doing. Not all hows are created equal. You have to do things you don't feel in the moment like doing. You'll resist the actions you need to take. If you do what you've always done, you'll get what you've always got. What got you here won't get you there. If you want bold results, you need bold actions. If you want it bad enough, your momentary feelings won't stop you. How you feel right now is irrelevant. Of course, it's out of your comfort zone. Of course, it may not feel good in the moment. Said Tim Ferriss, quote, a person's success in life can usually be measured by the number of uncomfortable conversations he or she is willing to have, end quote. Are you willing to disregard your momentary feelings to achieve a particular result? Start small. Life is practice. Every day is practice. Right now you're practicing, you're experimenting. Start with small stuff and work your way up. For me, taking cold showers is great practice. Even after doing it for years, I still often experience a moment of resistance but I feel the resistance and do it anyways. Within seconds, the resistance I was feeling is replaced with confidence and satisfaction. Confidence is an effect, not a cause. Identity is an effect, not a cause. Your behaviors and your choices of environment shape you from the outside in. What you do alters how you see yourself and the world. The more frequently you can confront and walk past emotional blocks, the more powerful of a person you will become you'll begin to believe in yourself because you'll have watched yourself act in a believable way. You'll ride some amazing emotional waves. You'll find yourself in situations and ask yourself, how did I get here 
How am I going to pull this off? But your confidence will grow because your behaviors and the situations you find yourself in lead you to believe in yourself. Wow, I'm really doing this, you'll say to yourself. Your beliefs and identity will change. They'll follow your courageous behaviors. You just need to walk past the emotional wall, the electrical fence, which paralyzes and imprisons 99% of people. Because people remain imprisoned, they doubt themselves. They develop a victim mentality. Their confidence crumbles. Rather than building the life they want, they settle for the life they have. Rather than living in an environment created by them, they live in an environment created for them. If you want something different, you need to act different. It doesn't matter how you feel in the moment. If that life is different than what you have now, you can expect it will feel terrible. You haven't yet adapted to your new life. What do you expect? Change is always an uncomfortable transition until you develop a tolerance for change, uncertainty, and even fear. Are you willing to go there? How big is the emotional roller coaster of life you're going to ride? Small rises and dips or huge rises, drops, spins, and twists? Life is meant to be lived. Emotions are meant to be felt and experienced. You get to design the roller coaster. Do you want the result bad enough that you're willing to feel absurd, horrible, amazing, ridiculous, and stupid to get there? Or would you prefer feeling safe and regretful? The choice is yours, but everything you want is available. And the more extreme the emotional shock you're willing to walk through, the faster you'll get the results you're seeking. Trust yourself. There must come a point when you stop worrying yourself over the opinions of others, even the opinions of your heroes. Your work and ideas must eventually come completely and unapologetically through you. Only when you fully trust yourself and your ideas will you be able to create in a bold, honest, and beautiful manner. No matter how successful you become, trusting yourself never gets easier. In fact, it only gets harder with more external noise and pressure. But you'll never be happy with yourself or satisfied with your work if you don't do what you truly felt inspired to do. Your most honest work will always be your best work. More than likely, it will also be your most successful work. You just listened to the post titled, How to Deal with Uncomfortable Emotions and Reshape Your Identity by Benjamin Hardy of benjaminhardy.com. This episode is brought to you by Hask. Hask hair care products are used on more Hollywood film and TV sets than any other brand. Hask offers high-performance formulas at affordable price points, including shampoos, conditioners, deep conditioners, shine oils, and dry shampoos that are designed to treat and repair all hair types made from high-quality ingredients sourced from around the globe. And Hask Biotin Boost Thickening Collection features a triple threat of ingredients sure to give fine, lifeless strands the lift they need. Biotin helps strengthen, volumize, and thicken to maintain hair health, Coffee stimulates the hair follicles, helping to boost strands, and collagen helps strengthen and fortify the hair shaft to protect from damage and breakage. Together, they enhance the appearance of thicker hair without leaving it feeling heavy. And I got a bunch, I was sharing with others, and the first comment I heard was how great it smells, thanks to their ingredient-inspired fragrances. You'll see when you smell it for yourself. All Hask products are free of sulfates, parabens, phthalates, and gluten, while formulated to meet the needs of your specific hair type. And the Hask Biotin Boost Thickening Collection is available at CVS. Shop now in store or online at cvs.com. And for more information on Hask's complete line of hair care solutions, please visit haskbeauty.com. And we thank them for sponsoring the podcast. All right, I'll leave it at that. Hope you're having a great day. Thank you for being here and listening to me and for subscribing to the show. And I'll be back over this holiday weekend reading to you. So I'll see you there where your optimal life awaits.